Hey, how's it going out there? Richard Ramirez coming to you from Pismo Beach, California. It's about 8 o'clock on a Sunday night. And today, after taking my advice from yesterday about reading other blogs, um, <laughs> um, this particular blog or article was found on my newsfeed today from a friend up in Northern California. So I decided to go ahead and take a look at it. And the blog itself is uh, lifehacker.com I guess it's or it's a website either one and it looks like it uh, pretty much talks about um, Chrome extensions you know Firefox extensions whatnot but this right here okay the title itself many browser extensions have become adware or malware um, so basically they're giving you a heads up to to double check your extensions. Um, even uh, Art Jonak posted the other day how, wh why is it that uh, when he goes to visit a particular website of something that he's looking to buy, he doesn't purchase it, but yet all of a sudden all these different ads start popping up trying to remind him <laughs> to buy that particular item. And now after reading this particular article, um, it definitely makes sense. Now, Lifehacker uh, uses HooverZoom as an example. And HooverZoom, what it does is it, 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 it's an extension off of Google Chrome. And it enlarges your pictures um, that you're viewing, especially on Facebook. You can you can hover over a picture instead of having to click on the picture to make it bigger you can just hover it and it just zooms like it's um, you know right there in front of your face so anyway as I pointed out that um, right here or in this particular spot is that uh, Hoover Zoom is sponsored via affiliate links this can this can be disabled in the options page without losing any features learn more about this in the Hoover Zoom, Zoom page um, and basically saying Hoover Zoom uses anonymous usage statistics so they're tracking you um, where you're going and now what how to geek is saying how to geek is is another website um, and so is this Ars Tec Technica. Now I'm not sure how you pr pronounce that, but you see it right there. <laughs> and you can read it for yourself. Also, I'll go ahead and leave the link um, below the video here. And, and it goes through and it tells you that basically some of these um, right here, these extensions are allowed to engage in the tracking behavior because they disclose it on their description page or at some point in their options panel. Um, so even even though it's it's telling you that they use an anonymous usage st statistics, it doesn't say in this description that they are going to track every single page you visit and send the URL back to a third party which pays them for your data okay so um, that's that's one thing you you might want to look into um, and they went ahead and they developed a list of various uh, extensions that have this particular um, device that they're talking about um, Firefox doesn't seem to have as many many extensions in that category and then one other site that they mentioned was this here about extension shield notifies you if you're running an adware extension okay which extension shield is also known as um, Chrome protector yeah um, and I went ahead it's it's an extension I went ahead and added it to my Chrome and um, sure enough I had four for these particular um, items that had malware on it so now I'm gonna have to do turn around and do another scan um, just to double check but 
I went ahead you know it tells you the uninstall over here so you can just uninstall and it gives you a it prompts up a message click on that and it takes it right off off of your um, browser so anywho I hope um, you get some value out of this and and go ahead and share it with others um, you know go ahead do do a video in your own voice and make a blog about it share it with your team um, you remember you're always one step ahead of the people that are following you so remember to do what you love with passion give yourself grace for the mistakes that you have made and continuously grow at least one percent than the day before and if you want to find out more about what I'm doing on the internet just go ahead and send me a message and uh, you can find me on Facebook or you can enter in your information right above alright take care have a good night